The story of All of a Kind Family by Sidney Taylor captures the lives of a Jewish immigrant family in early 20th century New York City. The narrative revolves around five sisters, Ella, Henny, Sarah, Charlotte, and Gertie, who live in a small apartment on the Lower East Side with their parents. The book is a reflection of the immigrant experience, Jewish traditions, and the deep familial bonds that sustain the family through their daily lives. The sisters' adventures are simple yet rich with meaning, offering a glimpse into the life of a tight-knit family navigating the complexities of their cultural identity and the challenges of poverty. The book balances everyday moments, such as cleaning the house or going to the market, with the warmth and humor that define the family's relationships. The strong sense of community in the neighborhood is evident, as the girls interact with neighbors, street vendors, and shopkeepers, creating a vibrant picture of their world. At its core, the story is about the resilience of the family, their ability to find joy in small things, and their commitment to one another. The sisters' personalities are distinct, yet they share a strong bond that is beautifully depicted throughout the book. Ella, the eldest, often takes on a maternal role, while Henny, the second oldest, is more rebellious and adventurous. Sarah, Charlotte, and Gertie, the younger sisters, each have their own quirks and strengths, adding depth to the portrayal of the family. Jewish traditions play a significant role in the story, as the family observes holidays like Passover and Hanukkah. These celebrations are woven into the narrative, not just as religious observances but as moments of connection and reflection for the family. Through these traditions, the book emphasizes the importance of cultural heritage and the ways it can provide comfort and stability, especially for immigrants in a new and often challenging environment. One of the most memorable aspects of the book is the way it portrays the children's resourcefulness and imagination. The sisters find ways to entertain themselves despite their limited means, whether it's through storytelling, reading, or making up games. This resourcefulness highlights their ability to make the most of what they have, and it speaks to the broader theme of finding happiness in the face of adversity. The narrative also touches on the broader social issues of the time, such as the struggles of immigrant families, the economic hardships they face, and the discrimination they encounter. However, these themes are approached with a light touch, allowing the story to remain accessible and engaging for younger readers while still conveying important messages about resilience, empathy, and understanding. The relationship between the parents and the children is another central theme. The mother is a figure of strength and wisdom, guiding her daughters with love and patience. The father, though often busy with work, is portrayed as a caring and gentle presence in the girls' lives. Together, the parents create a nurturing environment that allows the girls to thrive despite the challenges they face. Through its depiction of a Jewish immigrant family, the story offers a universal message about the importance of family, tradition, and community. It is a celebration of the everyday moments that define our lives, the small acts of kindness and love that sustain us, and the ways in which we can find joy and meaning even in difficult circumstances. In conclusion, the story is a timeless portrayal of a family that, despite their struggles, remains united by love, tradition, and their shared experiences. It is a story of resilience, resourcefulness, and the enduring power of familial bonds, offering readers a window into a world that, though specific in its cultural and historical context, resonates with universal themes of belonging, identity, and the strength of the human spirit.